Okay. Update. Out. <laughs> can you tell from my face? Wait, you can put the screen with you. We just found out that I'm having a C-section tonight. They said we had the option to. And we yeah. said... And we said, okay. We said we get to see a movie two days before it comes out. Of course. <laughs> of course we're going to no, say Jackson, yes. I turned to Jackson and I was like... Should we? Like, maybe we could wait till tomorrow or Tuesday. And he's like, a new toy. <laughs> I don't think I said that, did I? Yes. He's literally a little kid who just wants his I'm new just, toy. I'm just so excited. I'm the one who has to go into surgery. <laughs> I know, but you're going to go into surgery today or Tuesday. I know. Oh, yeah. So I talked to, I've been calling everyone to update them. I talked to um, Jacoby and she's had inductions and she was like calming me down a little bit and getting me more excited because she was like even if you go on the scheduled day like when it's a planned birth like that it's it still feels this way it's sort of mm. just like wait we're I mean, like it feels unexpected even though you've been expecting it yeah like she was like you never feel yeah. ready yeah it makes sense Cause I'm just like, this isn't the right words, I think, but it feels a little too easy. Hmm. You know? Like, it's like getting married a little, well, even getting married, you like, Yeah. I'm just thinking when you get married, there's like so much planning that goes into it. Also, it's all you talk about. It's like, also your whole life. You can back out of getting married, <laughs> like up until the very last second. We can't back out. We can't back out. The ball's rolling down the hill. We've already pushed this, pushed the first little snowball down the hill. You push those balls. Yep, push them right down the hill. So, but we're so, we're very excited. So I'm currently very very excited. <laughs> I'm getting more and more excited. Like I feel like it's just reality catching up, and now I'm like, we're having a baby. <laughs> I'm so excited though. I'm sorry you have to go through surgery, but I'm very excited for the after part of having a baby. I need to get all of Keith's stuff scheduled up. Look at her, still, still worried about work. Oh my gosh. Get yourself a work, working mama. It's okay, we have like a few hours. <laughs> Anyways, people here have been very nice, hmm. but the nurse was reluctant to give like too much pain medication finally gave Audrey pain medication, but told her she had to eat it with crackers, with graham crackers, so it was not an empty stomach. And then it's like, oh, actually, oh, actually you can get a C-section, but you have to wait a now while. now you have to wait since you ate. Now you have to wait six hours. That's why, even though it's, what time is it right now, like five, it's almost six, we have to wait until 10. But anyways, so back to you, back to okay. the process. So. So they're going to take me back at 9.30, they said, to do that. You look good in this lighting, by the way. Mm -hmm. Welcome. Last day of being pregnant. That's crazy. Look at this. Well, that's the monitor. It makes me look more pregnant. Still, though. There we go. <laughs> okay. Good thing I washed and curled my hair. Yeah. First of all. Too bad you can't see sectionally, you can't land, you can't sleep on your stomach. But you'll get there. So they're gonna take me back at 9.30, give me the spinal tap. Mm -hmm. They said Jackson can't go back, but, and then Jackson, they're gonna gown up Jackson. Mm -hmm. And then he's gonna meet me in the C-section room. And online it says the C-section takes 30 minutes to an hour. Mm. Okay. So let's say an hour. So what are we hoping for? What? Time Boy wise. Or girl? Time wise. <laughs> well We're hoping it doesn't go too long because tomorrow is Oh tomorrow's Pioneer Day. <laughs> yeah. So we want Nothing against oh, also, the Pioneers, but also, we just want our son to have his own day. Allie, you know? Allie pointed out that it's twenty the third twenty third of twenty twenty three. Ooh. So it's that's 23, cool. 23. That's cool. Yeah. 7, 23, 23. Nice. So if it takes an hour, then that'd be 
10.45. And then they put me in like the post-op room to monitor me for like good, another 30 good. minutes to an hour. Nice. So that's 11.45. And then we go into our recovery room. Okay. So it would be like midnight by the time that like people could people could. see you. Yeah. You're probably gonna be passed out though, to be oh, honest. I'm probably be so tired. Yeah. But I kind of want a nap right now if I can. Sure, take a nap. I can. <laughs> You're too excited. Yeah. That's okay. All right, there you have it. Oh, and Bria said she's coming at 9 p.m. Okay. To film a little bit. Something, nice. something, and then she'll film us. I think she's able to go to the recovery room at least. Okay, us. nice. Um, and then she's going to come back tomorrow morning to get some good lighting. Shots. Okay, nice. Cool. There you have it. Keep you posted. <laughs> Audrey's amazing. Well, I'm how you get natural attraction. Baby's getting excited. To yeah, come he out. is. So, where did you go, Jackson? Well, I distinctly remember saying only one of us should be hungry right now, right? <laughs> so I went to go get Taco Bell, partly because right now I'm like nervous but not anxious. But I know that as time goes on, I'll probably get more anxious, not be able to eat. Yeah. And I want to be my best self. Can I just say? What? Is it filming me? Uh huh. I'm pretty pissed off. <gasps> that you can only, like the food I ate for six hours before the procedure was graham crackers. Oh yeah, yeah. I would have rather had like a green smoothie at least or something. Yeah. Or like a Ruth's Chris steak or something. Yeah. Yeah, it's pretty, pretty lame. I got forced into my last meal being graham crackers. But to be fair, there are several days that you go, that you go through by only eating like less than that, so. <laughs> I'm really glad that I ate. You're really good at eating dinner with me. I'm really just glad not that breakfast I or lunch. Ate the yogurt granola. Yeah, oh. same. And the protein shake this morning. Yeah. Otherwise, I'd be really dead. Okay. Anyways. Gosh. Oh yeah. Back to me. <laughs> oh yeah. So Jackson went to Taco Bell. Went to Taco Bell. Got the cheesy gordita box. I'm uh, glad you did. Sorry, because let me cover Audrey's ears. <laughs> cheesy gordita box. I'm glad you did though because hangry Jackson is not fun, Jackson. Angry Jackson is not that bad. It's <laughs> tired Jackson. That's bad. That's true. Um, maybe, yeah, so uh, maybe we should do a C-section in the morning, not tonight. <laughs> get a full night's sleep. No, uh -huh. I'll take a nap with you. Okay. Anyways, we'll keep you posted. Wait. Okay, here we go. Here's our update. I it's got the been. IV. Oh my gosh, it's been so long since we've done an update. It's been like 15 minutes. I got my IV. Nice. I got my bands. The doctor came and talked to us. He's really cool. Super cool. First doctor oh, we saw. Also. And like, out of this whole experience. Yes. Oh, yeah. As in like nine when months I, ago. When I first found out I was pregnant, scheduled the appointment, we went and we saw this doctor. Yeah. And we liked him back then. Yeah. We, and we like him now. And we've seen like different doctors each appointment because it's a group of doctors. So it's kind of fun that the first doctor we had is mm -hmm. that the doctor delivering the baby. Doctor came in and the nurse had told me that we couldn't have Bria come in to film the C-section. Not like film the procedure, but I want the baby and us seeing the baby for the first time told. And the nurse said no, but the doctor said yes. <laughs> so we get to have her come in. I still don't like want to get my hopes up. Because I feel like if I... Yeah. Just low expectations, but then... Low expectations, but also there's a change. There's a chance. So you're saying there's a chance. So you're saying there's a chance. Huh? He said, well, oh, and he said, Audrey's allowed to have water. water. Thank goodness. They didn't tell us that before. The nurse said, Audrey has really good veins. So that's good. See, look at them. So good. Yeah, look, the blood's splattered out here. Yeah. Skill issue. Um, but yeah, we're talking about how we, like when we got married, it was so weird from one day to the next. And the night before we were like, what the heck? Like the day before you're just like, this is, we're never gonna be single again. We're gonna get married. And now it feels weird to not be married. That's how I feel like it's gonna be with having a kid. It's like, 
yeah, it feels weird not to have a kid, but once we have one, it'll it'll be weird not to know our little guy, you know? Like, not knowing me so well, well. Yeah, like, yes, I was just compared our child to our cats, but... You're the one who <laughs> said our baby was a toy. Yeah, that's true. I just love our cats so much that I'm like, if I can love cats this much, imagine our child. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Also, it's so weird thinking we're about to meet the thing that's been growing in me for nine months. I know, look at this little guy. <sighs> so cute. So cute. Also, I was going to go get my nails redone, like filled, because they're already growing out, but no time. No time. Look at it. No time. <laughs> my face is still puffy from me crying so much this morning. She has beauty, she has grace. It's our last like four hours, three hours before. With just us two? With just us. Yeah. I can't even think. I'm just. We're so excited. And we just saw the, my cousin and his wife just had a baby like a week ago. Chandler and Amy. Chandler and Amy. And we just saw their photos, like their first photo drop. Oh, such a cute little guy. I'm so excited. What's up? I think we're having this baby. Isn't that crazy? Crazy. Here's Audrey. Hi, Audrey. <laughs> How are you feeling? Uh, like this isn't real. It's so weird. <laughs> it's like surprise you're having your baby tonight in like three hours. <laughs> Is it a C-section? Yeah. yeah. Oh my god. So like, the doctor was like, yeah, like the position of everything, even if we could turn the baby, you'd probably be in labor for 48 to, 48 to 36 hours. Like it would be a really long labor. Yeah. So like, versus this way, we get a baby in 30 minutes. Baby Express. He said, he said from the time he did. He says from the time he does the incision, it's like it's five, five minutes. minutes to get the baby out. All right, guys, it's getting real. Just T minus one hour. Makeup. Yeah, Audrey's just touching up. Even though she already looks gorgeous, perfect time. Yeah. But yeah, we have. Uh, <laughs> they said they're actually ahead of schedule, so it was scheduled for like what time? Uh, ten, like nine forty-five, ten. But they said maybe even nine, which is in literally 40 minutes. It's crazy. We've been here since 1.30, but it doesn't really feel like it. Yeah. I was like, oh, it's going to take forever to be 9.45. And then all of a sudden it's 9. It's 8.17. Yep. I literally, Audrey can't get up and I can't stop pacing. So... <laughs> Sorry for the shaky cam, sorry for the Hunger Games camera work, but just so excited and nervous. We'll see you soon, baby boy. See you soon. Love you already. What? I should not have worn red today. Why? I should have worn blue. Oh, <laughs> but you have blue like, scrubs. There's like 5% chance. Okay, Jackson's getting scrubbed up. Yep. See if it's long enough. Holy cow. <laughs> so that it runs big it does. Okay. There's that. You ready? That's fine. Yeah. <laughs> I'm so ready. <laughs> Excited, nervous. I feel like this is oversimplification, but like in high school and I had like a big basketball game coming up. And I'm just so nervous. <laughs> Okay, here is Thank you. 
Oh my goodness, he's so, so cute. I know. You should be with him. I know. Yeah. I know. Update. Hold on. I can't be chewing. I gotta fluff my hair. Okay. <clears throat> Update. More parents. Look at the little guy. This you gotta. Is the best day of my life. Literally the best day of my life. He's so cute. I think he just tooted. All that good stuff, but he's happy and healthy. This is Reggie Ray and so Small. Is Reggie Ray Small. Reggie Ray Small. He was born on July 23rd, 2023. So 7 23 23. He weighed 7 pounds 14 ounces. 7 pounds 14 ounces, 21 inches long. Born at exactly 9 o'clock p.m. with Taylor Swift blasting in the mm -hmm. OR. He and had CPAP for an hour, he but then did. he did great and then I they got him able, off CPAP. I wasn't able to be with him right away, but Jackson was. He was so cute. Because he had to go to the NICU for a little bit. But now he's perfect. Remember when he was in your tummy, moving around, and you feel his legs and stuff? The way he's moving now against my body is like when he was <laughs> And I'm like, yep, yeah, this is him. This mm -hmm. is who was in there. He's so cute. It's just so crazy that he was in there. I love him so much. Same. Little noises are so cute. And here is those are little footprints. Cute little footprints. <laughs> and what time is it right now? It is like two in the morning. Yeah, two oh seven. I mean, the chicken we've, pot pie. We've been here at the hospital for 13 hours. Mm -hmm. And it's been, what, 9 o'clock is when I went in for the C section. So 9, 10, 11, 12, 22. Only five hours since we actually started the process. Audrey's still in a lot of pain. But I don't think she regrets coming I mean, in for her, for her sciatic. Pain. Yeah, compared to the back pain that I was in last night, 
I told the nurse I know I'm loaded up on drugs right now, <laughs> but I feel so good. <laughs> Best pain medicine right here. Okay, and Jackson's eating his chicken pot pie. Oh. It'll bug his tummy. There we go. From the nutrition room. Also got some strawberry yogurt. And I got Sprite and cranberry. <laughs> Every once in a while I get pretty dizzy, like just now. Mm. Whoa. But the nurse said that I'm recovering pretty well. I'm not bleeding too much. Um, I really don't want to jinx it, but this has been pretty nice. I might have to do a C-section every time. Knock on wood, knock on wood, knock on wood. Because <laughs> again, I'm loaded up on pain meds, so. <laughs> but come on. The only sad part was having to wait for him when he was in the NICU and not being able to be with him right away. But, but that's not all the time. Yeah. It's yeah. more common to see section, but it's not a guarantee that Yeah. That but it made me happy that Jackson got to be with him. Sort of like, I got to carry him in my belly. Mm -hmm. But then you got to spend like the first hours of his life with him. Jackson's such a good dad. First five hours of it. Yep, already starting off strong. Okay, good night. Good night. See you tomorrow. Literally fell asleep instantly. <laughs> Aww. Bring him over here so I can see. Oh my gosh. You're okay. All right, I'm here visiting my grandson. I'm very happy. And G Nana is here. Nana G. OG. OG, Nana. <laughs> what do you think, Mom? Oh, he's perfect. He is absolutely Not too the small, cutest thing. not too big, just right. Oh, he's so little. You forget how new babies are so tiny. His little lips, and they're just perfect shape. And his big feet, 13 and a half. His feet are really large. We brought sandwiches and Andrea's and Ellie's gift. Yeah, when you feel good enough, I want you to sit up and open. Audrey looks great. Dalton Except sent Dumbo. Sweet. Audrey looks great. You know, I for a while before you guys got here. Oh, did you? There's the sign okay. we made for it last night. Right the information. There we go. That's the Was one. Your just so yeah, I am for your mom and dad. So excited and so happy. Best day ever. What is going on, you guys? Oh, what is going on, you guys? Hold on, I, gotta Drink, go. I like drinking water a lot more when I don't have to get up to pee every hour. I just have the catheter. In. <laughs> like I can chug the whole thing and there's no consequences. <laughs> the only consequence is hydration. Amor, por qué? Por qué haces así? Oh, what is going on, you guys? What is going on, you guys? Oh, what is going on with us? So, update. Baby's here. Did we already do an update that baby was here? I know. I don't know. Anyways. <laughs> it's been a long night. How long were you in labor? Do they even... Oh, it's like in five labor minutes. for yeah. 10 minutes? <laughs> 30 minutes? Yeah, she's had so much pain with her arthritis for Yeah, it felt like I was in labor for two weeks at least. Yeah. I told Audrey to sleep last night, but she just wanted skin-to-skin -skin contact. 
so she, they don't she got one falling, hour They don't want you falling asleep with the oh, yeah. baby holding him. Yeah. They don't want to sw swaddle him back up and put him in the bassinet. He's so cute. Cause he would, he balls up so much when he's up against me. Yeah. And I'm like, okay, I can see how he was fitting in my belly now. And when he was bored, his legs were clear up uh -huh. like a frog. Yeah. He's still got the frog legs out to yeah. the side. So yeah, as soon as the doctor pulled out little Reggie, he showed Audrey the baby through the curtain. like curtain, mm -hmm. the clear curtain. So this is your baby, say hi. Yep. And, and I then, started crying. And crying. then they did like yeah. APGAR score, all that stuff. He was kind of struggling to breathe, so then they put him on CPAP for an hour. And I got to FaceTime everyone. That was awesome. Group FaceTime call. Yeah, Thank you, first, Steve Jobs. At first they said, okay, he's going to be on the wait table just for a little longer because he's not breathing on his own very well. I was like, okay. And then I was like, can I hold him now? And they're like, we're actually taking him to NICU. And I was like, mm. And then they're like, but Jackson come with. They're like, you can choose. And I was like, this is hard. The anesthesiologist was so nice. He would, he was like more helpful than the doctor, like walking me through everything that was happening, not just like with the medications. Usually they're like, okay, I'm giving you this for this. If you're feeling anxious, I'll give you this, you know? Mm -hmm. But he was everything. He was like, okay, that tugging feeling that you're feeling, that's totally normal. That's just them. Um, doing this part and he was explaining everything with so much detail oh, was so nice. nice yeah he was kind of younger i would mm -hmm. say and he was so thoughtful i think and he said this was his he's pretty young like this is his first thing he's ever done <laughs> <laughs> no he was um, great though the nurses were also like yet. similar okay. to that whereas i was watching they were just like oh, so we're testing this blah 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 this yeah. is why the alarms are going off but it's nothing to be concerned about we're going to take him back to the NQ. This happens very regularly, and I was just like, Yeah, they were all so like, I good never about felt panicked because they yeah. kept us informed the whole time, which was awesome. Yeah, even when they took Reggie to the NICU, the anesthesiologist was like, Don't worry, this happens with C sections because with vaginal birth, they have this process, but with C section, they don't get that. Blah, blah. Yeah. And he was like explaining everything, and I'm like, Okay. Oh. Tears running down my face. <laughs> oh, I know. I got nervous just watching. We're all hovering over my phone. Mm. Me and your brothers and Nana, and just watching, going. Mm. Okay, take my. I face. felt just. I was just glad you were there. Like, yeah. okay, Jack is right there. And I'm glad I, everyone could be watching too. Okay, take my picture again. I didn't comb my hair before I left. You didn't Mom, tell me that. That's really good. So I can't believe I let you take my picture of my hair and stuff. I didn't comb it before I left this morning. He's exactly like I thought he was up though. Same here. I guess so it's a weird thing that you're like, yeah, that looks like your baby. So they put him on CPAP for an hour. They give him extra fluids because the circulation was low. So they like gave him an IV, did some something, yeah, which improved his circulation and his um, like color, I guess. Uh, uh, yeah. And then after an hour, they're just like, yeah, we're just gonna watch him. And um, once the doctor gets here, he'll kind of decide if if he can go back. But Audrey wasn't anxious at all in here. And I was just <laughs> wheeled into this room, completely okay. numb. But aware, like, it wasn't like general anesthesia was wearing off, like, I'm like, okay, where's the baby? But I couldn't, like, get up and walk. And they were like, whichever comes first, either your numbing wears off and you can safely get into a wheelchair and go see him, or he might be able to leave the NICU sooner and come to you. Whichever comes first is when you'll be able to see the baby. So it could be one hour or it could be five hours. And I'm like, what? Yeah. And that's not uncommon either. <laughs> Babies a lot of times will do like four or more rounds of CPAP. Yeah, so that's what that's they like were four saying. Hours, at least. Each round of CPAP is an hour. And they were like, a lot of babies, it's not uncommon where they have to do 
four or five rounds and I'm like, I'm out of my mind. Yeah. But then when they brought the baby and then I got to get a little video of holding him for the first time, which was kind of fun. That was nice. It's all like, makes sense. Like he's okay. Me, oh, I was, <laughs> I was just, you know, oh, just watching him be <laughs> emotional. <laughs> Look at Griffin peeking in there, it's so cute. Oh, Griffin loves babies. Griffin is oh. so cute. <laughs> Second full day. Second full day. <laughs> Here's Audrey with her, where'd you get that? Chop it. Japan. <laughs> I was Japan. trying to say Japanese fan, yeah. Japanese but I got fan. it from Japan. Pretty awesome, mm -hmm. five bucks, no big deal. Japan's yeah. awesome, but <clears throat> uh, Dalton here with his new boutique he's just started called Griffin's Closet, featuring yeah, Don't Fret merch. I just wanted to give you a quick And we got uh, Mama so, Wells. Love you. And of course, so baby dumb. Reggie. Here, let me flip it around. There he is. How's he doing? Did he spit up a little, looks like? He's doing so good. Good. <laughs> but yeah, we're just loving hanging out with Reggie so much. Yeah. I brought my switch. I brought my laptop so we can watch shows together. We haven't had to do any of it. We've just been literally watching Reggie and holding him and stuff. We haven't even played Monopoly Deal. We haven't even played Monopoly Deal. But yeah, it's been great. The nurses have been awesome. Um, they come in and you know ask Audrey if she's doing okay. They weighed Reggie last night. Gave him a hearing test this morning. Everything's great. Um, Audrey's not as itchy anymore. Yeah, you want to talk about that a little? Goodness. Are you kidding me? <laughs> I give him candy, he spills it in my bed. Brotherly love right there. So what, what happened with the itchiness? The medication they gave me for the C-section apparently can make you itchy. It made me die. Of itchiness. Of itchiness. I was super itchy the first night. It made it really hard to Dalton's trying to steal my snacks. I'll just explain it. How Jackson explain it? No. She got super itchy, so they gave her some medicine for it. But it kind of wore off like, like the medicine would wear off. And then um, she would need more of it. But there'd be like an hour in between where it's super itchy. Um, and they were like, oh, it's not super common. It'll wear off super fast. But it was probably the most uncomfortable part of Audrey being here. Yeah. So. The itchiness was more painful than my incision at first. At first. Yeah. Now the incision pain is starting to get worse. Yeah. Because of like all the bruising and stuff, it's like setting in more. Yeah. But yeah, we've had a lot of great visitors. We had family come over yesterday. It was Pioneer Day, which it's a day very close to my heart. Um, <laughs> oh, and Reggie's like eating way more now. So he was like eating probably like 10 milliliters is kind of what we were trying look to get him to eat. This boy now is. it's like 30. Mm -hmm. And look at those Gains. legs. Look at these legs. Aw, long and skinny. Yeah, I wonder where he got those from. Mm -hmm. I think insurance covers two more days. So we're deciding whether it's nicer to be at home with all of our stuff or be here with all the nurses. Yeah. Okay, here's my you hospital lunch. Right yeah, I think. Got a BLT. <laughs> Apple pie. This is the first day you're staying in the full salad. And then Mom and Quinn are changing Reggie. What is going on, you guys? Oh. Little gas or little poops? That was a poop. Or big poops. Yeah, it sounded kind of squishy. <laughs> Audrey got a nap in. So yeah, update from last time. We had, we've had a lot of guests today, which has been great. It's been fun getting everyone of, to hold the baby. A lot of guests and a lot of gas. <laughs> a lot of guests and a lot of gas. And Reggie's been a champ through the whole thing. Uncle Foster came out. He fed little baby Reggie and he drank yeah. a lot of formula. Foster's not, like, not, oh, how much is he supposed to have? Reggie. Yeah, yeah, Reggie. We're like, I don't know, like, 20 to 30, and he's like, oh, it's at 40. He drank 41. I was like, okay, cool. Point celebration for dinner. Celebration dinner. Point for Mountain Point. Holy Cross. Holy Cross. 
hospital? Well, almost all hospitals do the celebration. Dinner. Okay. But we'll see how good their food is. Yes. That's the true test. <laughs> All right, day three. What just happened? I had two really good surprises today. One, Todd, Todd Dorney, from Hawaii, showed up. No, we get, we woke up by my mom calling Audrey. No, and, she texted me. Oh, texting Audrey and saying, awake. hey, Todd's in the parking lot. She said, are you awake? <laughs> I said, yeah. She said, Todd's in the parking lot. Didn't even know he was coming to Utah. I'm like, what? So we got to see Todd, and Todd got to see Reggie, and then second surprise of the day was this massage therapist knocks on the door and is like, can I come in? Complimentary foot massage. I'm like, bring it on, <laughs> baby. I'm chilling here with Reggie. Got my little guy. He's so good. He's just been chilling. All right. Third surprise of the day. Is, Not even a surprise, but Audrey's wishes came true again. This is what I've been waiting for. Mm -hmm. Her first sushi since Japan. Since Japan. Mmm. <laughs> mm. That looks so mm. good. I told Grammy this is what I've been looking forward to. She thought it was so funny, so... She said her baby gift... Push present. Push present. Oh my gosh, she's snoring. <laughs> Was, um, she Venmoed me money to get sushi. Aw. Nice. Oh. I think you're okay. Oh Jackson got us in and out. Mm-hmm. Uh -huh. <laughs> Reggie's sleeping. We're getting ready to go home. <laughs> I'm putting on a clean pair of pajamas nice to get ready for the day look at how amazing she is c-section oh. a few days ago already walking around <laughs> running jumping basically <laughs> there's little baby reggie oh, I am super nice excited to go outfit. home to put him in that roll out of here and we're good to go oh, look we got a time traveler out here from the late me. 90s Ooh. trying out just Fresh off the press of a Backstreet Boys uh, oh, yeah. audition. <laughs> love it, love it. Hey. Looking nice. Sure? Mr. Quinn with the nice colored shirt that oh. totally matches shorts. There's some debate. He doesn't think so, we all think he looks oh, straight fire. Well, that was a, up to a debate. <laughs> Did you like a how to? <gasps> Look so how sweet cute. he is. He's like, hi, hi Nana. Nana. Hi, Nana Tammy, how are you? All right, you ready? It's about color. Mm, looking good. Color, good for yeah. Postpartum. Yeah. I'm out here looking for them postpartum tents. And I got one right here. Oh my mm -mm -mm. God. Okay. Just the car seat for away. little baby Reggie. Oh. And his mama hooked him up with a doona, so he doesn't even know how good he's got it. Do you need to loosen it? I have no idea. Reggie's POV. Bless you. Thank 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 you.